What is going on guys? This is so funny. So this is my last day in Brazil. If you're new to my channel, I am in Brazil um, and uh, visiting here. Uh, not to make videos, I'm actually here for other reasons, for personal reasons, but while I'm down here, I'm certainly gonna do some fishing. And I caught my first couple peacock bass this trip. So I'm out here, this is the last day I'll be here though. And um, <clears throat> my girlfriend's uncle did something very cool for me. He let me use his kayak. It's basically Brazil's version of a Hobie kayak. Check this out. We out here, uh, <laughs> this little trolling motor, uh, right in the middle of the kayak here. And then, uh, this is this reminds me of, you know, like the nice Hobie or Jackson kayaks, only it's Milua Nautica. Um, so I guess that's a Brazilian brand, or at least I've never seen this before. We got storage up front. We got this really nice adjustable seat. We got the big battery for the for the uh, trolling motor and um, super nice kayak. In fact, let's see if I can stand up in it. Yep. <laughs> you can stand up. <laughs> this is crazy. So it's just like a Hobie kayak. Pretty cool. I'm going to be fishing today for I don't know what. Uh, I think we got peacock bass on the list. Oh, I know we have peacock bass for sure. What am I talking about? I know we have peacock back on the bass on the list, but then he mentioned to me a whole bunch of other um, fish I had never even heard of. There are also piranha in here, so, I mean, this is Brazil, you could catch. They have like freshwater stingrays here. So, so many cool types of fish. Let's start casting. All right, guys, the top water has just been put on. Nothing on some swim baits and a jerk bait, but here we have a little classic uh, hidden spook. Let's see if this catches fish in Brazil. Oh, there's a couple of fish jumping right behind me. Yep, they're feeding, they're feeding. There's some sort of fish feeding right behind me, guys. I literally just tied on this top water. Uh oh, fish, fish right there, fish. Did you see that? Did you see that bite? Oh my gosh. Guys, did you see that bite? Oh, I have my drag set too light. Oh, it's a peacock bass. It's a peacock bass. Oh my gosh. Did you see that slash? <laughs> Oh, that was amazing. Look at this peacock bass. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Boom. Are you kidding me? That thing just slashed it. Oh, that is the biggest peacock bass I've ever caught. Also, the third peacock bass I've ever caught. Oh man, guys, look at that. That is a beautiful peacock bass. Oh, that is incredible. I know it's not a giant, probably most people who catch them a lot, but to me, it's it's like, you know, it's my only, th my third one, so I'm super proud of that fish. It just annihilated the Zoom Super Spook Junior. Oh, that is so cool. Oh man, they are all over feeding. I'm just like chasing, chasing splashes. Oh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Did you see that, did you see that? Okay, I gotta, I gotta sit down for this one. Did you see that bite? Guys, did you see that? Oh, oh my gosh, did you see that? Oh okay, okay, stay calm. Gosh, we are not in Idaho anymore. I better loosen my drag. Oh, look at that, look at that, look at that, right there, right there. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Look at that, come on. Oh, missed him, missed him, missed him, come on. He came back for it, got him, got him. I got it. <laughs> I just saw a wake. Oh, it's a peacock bass. <laughs> that was sweet. I was just fishing along and I saw Yes! And I, saw, and I saw the wake. Oh my gosh. This is the most exciting fishing I've done in a while. Besides that sturgeon fishing. Oh man, that was cool. 
<laughs> These fish are ferocious. That is what I'm talking about. Look at that guy. Oh man. This is so cool. You know what? This is a great eating size. It's about 13, 14 inches long. We're gonna keep this guy. Killed the fish. Perfect eating size. Oh. Fantastic evening out here guys, but I have family stuff I have to do. In fact, I'm a little bit <laughs> late. So, um, anyway, I will see you guys later. We're gonna cook up this peacock bass. I have to get back. And uh, tonight, we're gonna cook up this peacock bass. See you then. So, the rest of the family has gone to bed. So I'm gonna be talking quietly for this next little segment. I actually just spent the last couple hours packing up because I'm leaving Brazil in the morning. So, but I really wanna eat the bass that I caught. So we're gonna have a little midnight snack here. Um, I'm gonna scrounge around the kitchen and prepare this somehow. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna season this fish with stuff that I've just found around the house. I remember this isn't my house. So, um, and then I can't read a lot of labels because they're in Portuguese, but I do know that uh, we have salt here. I found, I don't know if I'm gonna use this. Anyway, I found this, looks like a Japanese, like, shoyu. I don't know what shoyu is, but, and then we found this. It's called seam pimenta. And I know pimenta in Portuguese means pepper. And it just smells really good. I'm just gonna use it. It's like a fine grain. Yeah. All right, on this awesome Mickey Mouse plate, we got the two fillets. Gotta have the most essential ingredient. Salt. Then we're gonna go with this stuff. You know what this stuff smells like? It smells like a ramen noodle packet. We're gonna rub that into the fish. It tastes good. It just tastes a little bit. It tastes salty though. It tastes really salty. We may have really salty fish. I'm just gonna put this stuff on one fillet. Alright. Got some nice pepper. Stove, pan on stove. After scrounging around in the kitchen, found some olive oil. So I'm just gonna cook the fish instead of butter, which I do love. I'm just gonna cook in olive oil. Hope nobody wakes up because I'm cooking. A little bit of olive oil. All right. We're gonna We're just going to cook it in a little bit of, I'm pretty sure this is soy sauce or very similar. that come in ramen noodles when you rip them open it smells like that so you know it has to be good a little salty and then we got that whatever that is much better Mmm, that was really good. Mmm, soyu? That just sounds like soy sauce in Portuguese. Mmm, mmm, this one's really good. Cooking the peacock bass in soy sauce. Man, peacock bass, or probably any fish in soy sauce? That's good stuff. Oh look, 2.33 in the morning. This is just, just the thing to send me off to bed. Little peacock mouse. 
packed a lot into this Brazil trip. It has been a blast. I want to thank the family, the Tracos, for letting me come and showing me a good time and letting me go out in their boats. I've been fishing three times here. Actually, no, I've been fishing four times. One of them was kind of a fail. I didn't make a video out of that, but they fed me fish. They, they make sure I went fishing. It has been so much fun. So thank you guys. And thank you for hanging out. I'll see you guys in the next one. If you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing. See you guys in the next one.